In this video, you will find out what is the right amount of calories that you should consume. This is going to be based on your goals and your personal needs because it's going to be different from person to person. There are many ways to do this. There's all kinds of different formulas, calculations. We're going to make it very simple and very precise. Your first task is to start tracking your calories. After every meal, you will calculate how many calories you consumed. You can use Nutritionix to find out how many calories are in the foods that you are eating. Just search for it on Google and you will find it. It's like a large database that's going to give you a very precise number of calories and other nutrients. Another way is to use some sort of app that is going to calculate this for you. My Fitness Pal is one of the most popular ones. You can check it out if you want to. So, at the end of the day, you will see what is the total amount of calories that you consumed. After a week of doing that, you will know exactly how many calories you're consuming on average, and that is your maintenance. This is the amount of calories that your body needs on a daily basis in order to maintain your current weight. The second thing you need to do will be stepping on a scale every morning after the washroom and writing down your body weight. It's important to do this in the morning on an empty stomach to get the most accurate results. I will provide you with the sheet where you can write down your weight. Just download the sheet and you'll be able to use it. And the third and final thing that you gotta do is download some sort of app on your phone that is gonna track your daily steps. Any sort of app will work. So now you're getting pretty good at tracking your calories. You know what your maintenance is. You're getting into the habit of stepping on a scale every morning and you know what is your average daily activity. This is a very good foundation from where we can start working on your goals. So these are the first three tasks that you have to do. Start tracking your calories, start scaling, and start measuring your daily steps. Once you know what your current caloric intake is, and you know approximately how much you're moving during the day, then go to the next video where, I, where you will learn how to manipulate those calories in order to reach your goals. That's it for this video. You have work to do. And then see you in the next video where I'm going to give you the next steps. Bye.